Thailand, Thailand, Asia, Thailand. <laughs> <laughs> I was adopted when I was four by, can I say white people? Is that racist? By, by、uh, Caucasian? Oh, but I'd like to go back to Thailand. It's definitely one of my, I'd like to find my mom. So, we need to track her down, but I have、um, one picture where we can only see half of her face. And、uh, I have a little journal that they gave me with address of the orphanage where I grew up and、um, address and numbers that I could try to. Yeah. So, I could maybe find her. Maybe not. We'll see. It was hard for me to. Fit in, it was more like I was pretending to be that person I wasn't, and also I didn't know who I was, I was just being、um, what I was being told to be. Like, I was being told to be pretty and wear skirts and act feminine and like boys, and that's not who I was. I felt, I felt like a clown, like, I couldn't be really myself. I felt like I was. I used to have long hair and、um, I'm actually gay and I used to pretend that I'm not gay and I think that's what I'm trying to do is just show that it's like we're, we're just this whole spectrum of everything and it's okay to be our true self and, that's, and we shouldn't pretend for something we're not because sometimes I just look around and I feel that everything is just so fake and I. It makes me feel empty, and I feel that's why it makes other people so empty and depressed and sad and anxious. And that if they were just real and authentic, they wouldn't feel so sad anymore or empty. That was intense, sorry. <laughs> I really believe that there's something like above, because we're not perfect, so this must be something perfect, right? My... It's because my best friend passed away last year and we found him in the river. And I came from a background where I, I used to drink every day and use a lot of drugs. And I, would, I just lost myself. And, and, and then I, what really helped me is just find my higher power and just music, like it's cheesy, I can't sort of save my life because I feel that when I'm not using and when I'm playing, Then I know that I don't need to use because if I'm using, it's just it's numbing myself. When I'm playing and I, I'm being more able to connect with my higher power, but also I feel that my friend is still, he's still here and that's my way of、so、connecting with him. That's what I want to do. Like, I want to open myself so, so people just open themselves too, you know? So that's how you're not so lonely. Like, if I'm being able to be there and so open, then people will just feel that they can do it too. I want to create this community where everybody feels not so lonely. And actually, that's why I wrote Everyone Matters.、Um, it's a song about love, but like, not like love in relationship, but love in general. And I really wanted people. To feel that everybody gets sad, everybody gets lonely, everybody's just reacting to life, just experiencing life. It's okay to be vulnerable, it's okay to be sad, it's okay to experience any kind of feeling. Just because of past experience and making really bad decisions for myself, I realized that maybe I don't know what's good for me, maybe I do need others to help me grow and make me. Even like just see other p e r s p e c t i v e that I don't have, and that's what I want to create with music.